Hello, welcome back. Today I put together some vintage and some newer camping and outdoorsy sets that were really interesting that I thought would be fun to share. So let's take a look. So here we have a mishmash of a couple different sets. Um, so these trees are the only thing here that are not Sylvanian. Uh, they are from Lil Woodsy's. Uh, you can get them in the sidewalk pack. Uh, and each sidewalk pack comes with two trees and um, a bunch of little plastic connectable sidewalks. Uh, so it's a great set you can get for $10 to $20. Um, I, uh, Target carried them for a while. Uh, Walmart had them a little while ago too. Uh, okay, so these little tra uh, trail signs are from the Woodland Trail Picnic set, um, which came out, uh, was released by Flair. I think in 2007, so quite old. Uh, I got those secondhand uh, with this tent and uh, fire pit and these other camping accessories on eBay. Um, so this tent comes from uh, Baden and Michaela's Campout, I think is the name of the set or something similar to that. And it comes with the um, tent and the uh, teapot, uh, the fire pit, uh, now, the uh, Woodland Trail Picnic set comes with this kettle um, and a similar looking fire pit, um, but the same fire pit comes in the Baden and Michaela uh, camping set. Uh, and then we have uh, the Beaver Siblings Go Hiking, and uh, this I got brand new from uh, eBay uh, from Japan, a site called Kobe Japan. That's K-O-B-E-E -E, Japan. Uh, and they are the biggest seller of Slovenian families on eBay, I believe, at least uh, Japanese seller. And they have tons and tons of sets. Um, and uh, whatever they sell, they're gonna sell at usually the lowest price online. And they had this set brand new. They had a couple of them. And I think I got it for $25. Now with them, the shipping is, if you're in the US, is a flat $22, uh, no matter how much you buy. So if you're gonna place an order, you wanna kinda buy everything that you think you're gonna buy at once uh, to minimize your shipping. And then you can usually save money compared to getting it elsewhere. So that's where we got these Beaver Boys and they're super cute. And I'll give you a closer look here in a sec. And then over here we have the canoe. And I've got a few newer ones that I'll bring out in a moment. Um, the newer camping set and the elephant girl um, barbecue set and the swans. All right, well, let's take a look at the Beaver Boys first. <clears throat> I don't know exactly when they were, were first released, uh, but they are currently retired. Uh, and I think this set is probably at least uh, five or six years old, if not older, um, but they're just so adorable. They have the little beaver tail, and these boots, of course, are removable, and they've got the little teeth, and it's interesting. There are two versions of the beavers. There are beavers with teeth and beavers without teeth. Um, now, even if the beavers have teeth, typically the babies do not, um, and this is a newer uh, um, epic uh, version of the beaver, so it does have the tooth. Um, but interestingly, the calico critters um, version of the beaver tend to not have the teeth. So that's a little odd. But this fella does, and they have matching shirts, and the little baby boy has overalls. How cute is that? He doesn't have a little tail popping out. And the overall uh, is actually connected to the shirt, so it's uh, not too bulky and easy to dress. And he's got a separate pant and shirt with a hoodie. Look at that. And it comes with a couple accessories. Of course, my favorite are the backpack. Uh, there's two backpacks, and they open. They're kind of hard to get open. Um, and I don't want to open and close them too much because it'll start to wear them out a little bit. And then the blue backpack. And with the beavers come the um, thermos. It has a little design on it. 
and a sandwich, two half sandwiches, a banana, and a little watch. And the watch will fit on either one of the beavers. So those are the beavers going camping. Now let's take a look at this old, this vintage camp set. Uh, Baden and Michaela's camp out. Uh, I don't have Baden and Michaela. Uh, I got, like I said, I got this uh, second hand, but what I love about this tent compared to the newer tent, here's the newer tent. Um, it has a little window on the side and you can prop it open with the uh, string which runs through the, the tent. And on this one, what's that? Oh, um, you can tie, uh, you can actually tie it open rather than just leaving it flapped open. So it's got a tie, um, should, the, uh, the other tie must have uh, came out. So there's just this tie. And it has two Velcro compared to the newer one where um, this piece is kind of like that uh, almost felt, and it has Velcro. It has one piece of Velcro to attach it, um, but it doesn't have Velcro on the other side. It just sticks to the felt. And of course, there's no window, no string. So if you open it, you just, if you want to prop it open, you can kind of like, but it doesn't look quite as good as if it had the string. Um, all right. And I don't know if the original Baden and Michaela tent came with sleeping bags or not. Uh, when I got this set, uh, the seller uh, included um, these sleeping bags, which came with the um, family camper van, or the camper, the newer camper set. Um, but I uh, don't know if the original set had, a, had sleeping bags or not. All right, and let's take a look at what else came in the older camp set. Uh, here is this gorgeous little fire pit. I'm just going to move that tree because it just won't quit, quit falling over. Uh, and this comes in multiple parts. So you have the stones around it. You've got the fire uh, wood in the middle, which is uh, removable. And you stick these sticks in the little holes. And then this just rests on top. And then you can stick this pot through. Or um, in the camping set, the Baden and Michaela camping set, you can put this little um, teapot through. And that's how that was arranged. But I think it had a smaller stick for that set. So um, at any rate, um, that one won't fit on this stick, but uh, in the original camping kit, um, this was what went through the fire pit. So that's cute. You can cook your tea or coffee. Uh, and this is the kettle. It has a little lid that um, you can take off. And you can put your soup or corn or whatever you want in there and cook it. And it has two little benches. There are, uh, they look kind of like pieces of log, kind of glossy, uh, a couple cups. And I'm not certain if these accessories were with the green tent, the Baden and Michaela set, or with the Woodland Trail picnic set. It could have been either. And then you see here floating in the water are two plates, cups, and these kind of um, really cool looking vintage looking forks, and uh, one knife. The seller uh, had lost the other knife. Um, and then I love this little lantern. It's so cute and so detailed and realistic looking. But like all their stuff, just durable and high quality. Not flimsy and it won't break. And this little marshmallow stick with pink marshmallows so the critters can cook three at a time. Pretty cute. All right, um, and then finally, uh, this tent set came with the uh, little compass. Let's see if I can give you a good look at that. 
There we go. And so little. And binoculars. And they're just red on both sides. And they come with elastic bands so you can put them over your critters' heads. All right, and then over here is the canoe. Now this uh, water uh, plate came with the Seaside Restaurant. And um, this is the canoe set. I think I have a box for that over here. Comes with two life jackets. Now you can get another canoe set, I think that comes with a critter, or maybe not, but this was from Japan, from Kobe, Japan. Bought this a couple years ago, and I think I, I paid maybe $12 for it from there. Um, maybe more. Um, yeah, and those life jackets fit uh, kids and babies, but they, they don't really fit adults unless you really squeeze them on, which I wouldn't recommend. Um, and uh, of course the paddles, and then it has a little string so you can kind of loop it around the dock and uh, go for a canoe. And it's got that little logo there right here, Maple Grove Canoe. All right, let's try it on the beaver. I'll be right back. All right, we've got our beavers all safe in their life jackets. And the big brother is a manly man who's not afraid to wear pink, sporting the pink one. And you can see the little bunny in the corner, very cute. And they're uh, really easy to get on. They just, um, you can see how it just nudges in the hole right there. And this is a little big for baby, actually. I don't know what I, why I said it would fit baby. I mean, it fits, but it doesn't. It doesn't really close, and their or their arms won't really stick out. So it looks pretty silly on him, actually. And uh, even with the kids, um, if they have a lot of clothes on, like he has got a big piece of Velcro back there, and so that makes it pretty snug. So you want to be, you know, mindful of what clothes they're wearing before you put the life jacket on. Um, you know. Like a, a, like a simple thin shirt, it'll fit a lot better. So there you have it. Um, these are the older vintage ones, and uh, let's look at some newer ones.